Hello everyone, my name is Heather Moorfield Lang and this is my YouTube channel Tech15 and today I'm going to be talking to you about a very fun website called Storytime from Space. Now I'm starting on the About Us page from Storytime from Space, but if you go to storytimefromspace.com, you're going to find a great website exactly as it is described. It is Stories from Space. And the reason why I'm on the About Us page is because it's going to tell you what Storytime from Space is. And this is actually astronauts at the space station reading stories and conducting science experiments for the children on Earth as the world rotates below. Uh, this is a series of stories that have been sent to the International Space Station and the astronauts read books and stories and perform experiments that your students can do as well here on Earth. And so if you've ever wanted to have science experiments, if you've ever wanted to explore literacy and science, if you ever want to do collaborations with your science teachers, with your language arts teachers, this is an excellent tool to use. It is pretty new. They've only got about eight to nine stories. They are continuing to grow and they just released their first book in Spanish. If you go to the home page, it's going to take you to the most recent book that has been released. You'll see that this is their first book in Spanish. The books predominantly are by Jeffrey Bennett at this time. But if you look at the books length in the middle of the page, you're going to see all of the different books. The, the book that is in Spanish is by Jeffrey Bennett, as I said and it is Max Goes to Mars. You'll also see that they have Luciana Braving the Deep, The Mission to Kataria, Moon of My Own. They also have a book about Notable Notebooks, Next Time You See a Sunset, Max Goes to the International Space Station, Max Goes to the Moon, I've already got that one, Max Goes to Jupiter, Rhino Who Swallowed a Storm. You'll notice that this one's by LeVar Burton. You've got The Wizard Who Saved the World, and they have many others. Not all of these have been read by the astronauts so far. Not all of these have been read by the astronauts so far. You'll see that The Rhino Who Swallowed a Storm is a book on the International Space Station, but it has not been read yet. But many of these um, are on their way. Mousetronaut is a video down from the space station that's being edited. So you've got all different books that are coming and different ones that have been read. But if you see that if it's been read in space, you click on the book and it'll actually tell you where you can buy it. And so it'll take you directly to that link. That's just the books. So if you'd like to purchase the books to be able to read along with the astronauts, you can purchase those for your library, for your classroom collection, for your home collection. If you go to the video library, you're going to see all of the different stories that have been read so far. We have one in Japanese, we have one in Spanish. So if we click on Max Goes to Jupiter, you can see the video. And you can make it large, of course. To and it's gonna tell you story time from space. We're not gonna watch the whole video, of course, but you can very quickly see what the videos look like. This is a very easy website to use, very easy user friendly, very easy to see where everything is but this is a place where you can see the stories, read the stories, see how everything works. You can see the astronauts as they are showing the books, introducing the books, and you can purchase the books yourselves if you would like to read along or keep the books or purchase the books for your own child or for the students at school to be able to read these along with our astronauts at the International Space Station. So this is Storytime from Space a wonderful tool, great opportunities for um, science experiments. Make sure to check those out right here under the link for science experiments, for books, for literacy, videos of reading, um, as well as more information about all of our astronauts who are up at the space station and the books that they are reading. So thanks so much for watching. Please subscribe if you like what you see. More videos to come. Thanks so much. Have a great day.